Planners for Green Bay continue to work on a vision for the downtown area and the University Avenue corridor. Now, the plans are for redevelopment, not construction. Fox 11's Ben Crumholt shows us how the city is getting the public involved. After sending out more than 1,600 postcard invitations, this is the crowd that showed up Wednesday night to provide input on the redevelopment of University Avenue. I'm curious what they plan on doing. And I'm just kind of concerned with how it's kind of starting to look really dumpy in the area, and we want to kind of clean it up. City planners say they use a citizen approach anytime they're going through a planning process, like they are now with the downtown and University Avenue areas. We want to make sure that we are very transparent in what we do. We want to make sure that it becomes a community vision so that it has a better chance of being implemented versus something that may, that may finish and sit on a shelf after that. This meeting at Nicolay Elementary School is the second of six planned public meetings for the University Avenue plan. Our goal is to get a, uh, four different subject areas covered from the public. We want uh, quality of life, transportation, land use, and then the business environment. Residents were able to provide their input at four rotating stations. Um, just trying to get, like, getting bigger businesses, you know, supper clubs, maybe a, a nice hotel to get the people, instead of going to Appleton and staying there, or even the west side, coming to the east side. There's a few projects out there, and just nothing happening with it. After this meeting, the city plans to use part of a $200,000 EPA grant to hire a consultant for the project. Goals will then be formed and shared with the public to make sure they have a shared vision for the area. I'm going to cross my fingers and hope that they listen. In Green Bay, Ben Crumholz, Fox 11 News. Now, city leaders want to have the plan for the University Avenue area finished by, in about a year rather, the master plan for the city's downtown area is expected to be updated in the next six to eight months.